that very thin um, USB-C port at the bottom, that's 3D printed in titanium. The new Apple Watch, um, the high-end one, the titanium one, the sport watch, the chassis is made from titanium. So it used to be the case that you take a block of aluminum, block of titanium, block of steel, you shave it down, what we call subtractive manufacturing. And then you take all that scrap metal, boil it, make another block, and start over. And that was always cheaper. Now, somehow Apple, one of the biggest companies in the world, is able to create a titanium watch with additive, which means exactly how it sounds. You're adding dot by dot, right? And so there's no, there's no need to like uh, recycle the material, bring it back into another block. So they're able to do that at a cost that is cheaper than subtractive manufacturing. So yeah. this has gone from prototyping to 20% production. 